Today we'll be learning how to convert banana fiber or general plant fibers into paper. First you remove the outer strip of the layers from the banana plant, you know, just slice thinly near the surface. Then you dry those fibers, you can dry them outside in the sun or you can dry them in an um, oven with reasonably low temperature. Then you take those fibers and you cut them into about half or quarter inch pieces so that you can um, allow them to increase your surface area. You can weigh out maybe 15 grams, 50 grams, depending on the amount of samples that you're going to make. Um, you cook this fiber for approximately um, one and a half to two hours. Um, medium boil, allow it to just keep boiling. You can top it up with water as it goes along. Then you leave this to cool for about two hours, an hour. And then once you have finished doing that, then you rinse those fibers with tap water until it runs clear. And then you, you can keep rinsing it until as much of the sodium hydroxide is removed. Next, you take those fibers, you put about a handful of them in a blender with about 600 ml of water. And you blend them for maybe a minute or less until they become a pulp. Depending on the type of fiber, you might need more or less. Um, next thing is to rinse that again, um, strain off the water in order to get rid of as much sodium hydroxide as possible. And you keep rinsing. And you can add some hot water if you want to help remove a lot of the sodium hydroxide. Then you have now pulp. You take this pulp and you can weigh out maybe 13, 15 grams or, or more of the squeezed pulp and put that back into a blender, blend it until it separates and then you pour that in what is called a mold and deckle and the mold and deckle is used to form the sheet. You know, wiggle around your fingers to spread out the fiber and then you pull it out of the water or the vat and allow the water to drain off and then once you have done that the next step is to um, remove the the mold and take the deckle and you're going to transfer or couch the sheet onto a pellon or felt and you can stack several sheets like this then you take those sheets, you put them under a press, you use a, like a two-ton jack or so to squeeze the water out of the sheets. Transfer those sheets to a, um, in this case, it's like a whiteboard or some smooth surface. And you can leave them and put them in the sun or you can leave them overnight until the water dries out. And once you probably get up the next day, if you, it's better to leave them inside. You find a nice edge and you take your time and peel off each sheet. And then you can stack them and put them in the press again um, between two hard flat surfaces and squeeze out the water. Thank you.